All right, here's another question, but now this is more grade 12. And by the way, grade 12s, this is a very, very typical exam question. I took all of these questions from exams, but this one specifically is very, very uh, popular. Okay, here we go. <clears throat> so you can read the question yourself so long. The first 24 terms of an arithmetic series are that, 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 and that. Okay, calculate the sum of all the natural numbers that are not divisible by seven, that are not divisible by seven. Okay, so that would be numbers like 35. Natural numbers, guys, what are natural numbers? Natural numbers are numbers that you count with. So they said 35, 36, 37, 38, 39. I'm just going to write a few numbers. Don't worry, I'm not going all the way to 196. Just want to show you something. Okay, I'll stop now. Okay, so they want us to they want us to take up all these numbers all the way up to 196. Okay, but then they want us to find um, they want us to calculate the sum of all the natural numbers um, that are not divisible by seven. So what I think we should do so long is let's go calculate. Let's go calculate the sum of um, let's go calculate the sum of all of these numbers. We're going to go calculate the sum of all of those numbers. OK, so we know that that is a arithmetic pattern. Can you see it? It's plusing one each time. OK, um, now we can go use this formula. I'm not worrying about this part just yet, guys. Don't worry, I haven't forgotten about that. OK, um, but there's also another formula that would work quite nice. Oh, no, I don't like using that formula. OK, so the guys that we could use this formula over here. Now, the problem is is we don't know how many terms there are. So we do know that we're going from 35 up to 196. So you could say 196 minus 35, but then remember to plus one. So there will be 162 terms, 162 terms. If you had to count all the way from 35, up to 196, there would be, um, what did I say, 100 and 162 terms. So we can go SN equals to 162 divided by two, two times A. Now, what is A? A is term number one, so that'll be 35. N is 162, and the common difference in this sequence is plus one. Okay, and then we can go work this out. You might be doing this in a little bit of a different way right now. We will get to the same answer, you'll see. This is gonna give us 18,711. Okay, guys, so that is if you add up all of these numbers from 35 up to 196. That'll give you 18,711. Okay. Now what I want us to do is we are going to go calculate the sum of all of these numbers. Okay, we're going to calculate the sum of all of these numbers. So let's go. Um, can you guys see that these numbers are all divisible by seven? Uh, Tamron, where did the 162 come from? Um, the, the 162 is the number of terms. Now, Tamron, if you had to count from, if you had to count from 35, up to 196, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. If you had to count all the way to 196, there would be 162 terms, okay? You might just have to think about that for a bit, but there will be 162 terms. All right, guys, so what I want us to do now is to look at these numbers. Can you see that these numbers are all divisible by seven? Can you see that they are all divisible by seven? So let's go add them up quickly. Let's go add them all together. So the sum of 
um, let's just quickly say here, all numbers divisible by seven. So we can say Sn equals to n over two, two a plus n minus one times d. Now guys, they've told us that there are 24 terms. So we can say 24 of those. A will be 35. The number of terms is 24. But now look at the common difference. Can you see that we are adding seven each time? So that is the common difference over there. We can go ahead, type this in on the calculator and let's see what we get. 2,772. Now, I want you guys to read this question carefully and it should make a lot of sense what we've just done. Read this part carefully now. It says, calculate the sum of all the natural numbers from 35 to 196 that are not divisible by seven. Okay, so guys, check this out carefully. Um, if we add it up, some of you are saying you're not sure. Let me quickly show you. If you add up all of the natural numbers, all of the natural numbers from 35 to 196, we get 18,711. Now, if we add up all of the numbers that are divisible by seven, then what do we get? 2,772. Then they say, calculate the sum of all the natural numbers that are not divisible by seven. Okay, so we take all the divisible by sevens away. So we take them away, 35, 42. We're taking those away because they are not divisible by seven. And so the final answer will be 18,711 minus 2,772. And the final answer is 15,939. Excellent stuff, guys. Most of you who answered that, you got that correct. So well done.